Hi guys, I hope you remember me. This is Vatsala here with the entire team today. We are here in Whitefield shooting one of our clients video that is Neha Mohit Vijay. And I am here with Shweta, Yashas, Janil, Ramesh and Bharat. I would like to introduce each one of the folks who have worked literally hard in behind the screens and with the customer and traveling, taking the materials up and uh, fro to the site and making this wonderful house end into a sweet home. So Shweta is one of our uh, creative head who's sitting here and we have Ashes, the designer of this beautiful home and also he heads the North design team. And then we have uh, Janil, Mr. Janil, who takes care of the relationship management. And we have Mr. Ramesh, who leads the ma project management team of the North Branch. And yes, we have Mr. Bharat, who is the marketing head. And I'm Vatsala here explaining you this house. Hi, this is a uh, foyer area wherein uh, we have been cropped a uh, foreign imported uh, stone cladding wherein it is highlighted with rafter containing three spotlights. And here in this side you can see a uh, arch theme wherein again it is imported with uh, three spotlights which in where the arch part is concealed with wires. And you can see the beautiful storage wherein it, it can incorporate more than 20 to 30 pair of uh, shoes or something. And here once we are done with the foyer, uh, we are entering the living area. Now to give a warm welcome in the living area, we have given a rafter which is brown in colour and to maintain the theme, we have used the same round laminate and the shade of it in these drawers. Now if you see, we have given a huge TV unit for this amazingly huge TV and we have given some open cabinets, some closed drawers and one grass table. So we are in the dining area now and as you see this crockery unit is very well designed. It's in a step shape and the top cabinet and the bottom cabinet is very well maintained. It continues to the puja unit which is in an R shape and soon there's gonna be few more additions like a CNC cut partition is gonna come behind it and that will make it a complete look. So this kitchen is very well designed and it's an L-shaped kitchen with Tiesta Rose laminate in the bottom cabinets and white glossy finished laminate in the top. Now in the bottom units we have given a lot of tandem boxes, bottle pullouts and we have given a tall unit with a little space of uh, microwave and two openable sh shutters. So we are in Moika's bedroom now and because she wanted a pink colored bedroom we have given a very nice white and pink colored wardrobe with two mirrors over here and uh, we have given the loft in white color because it makes the room look a bit wider. Now to maintain the rhythm, we have designed a study table with pink and white laminate. Now this whole bookshelf, it looks like one unit but it's actually separate separate units over here. And we have given a whiteboard for the kid to draw or write or maybe make a to-do list. And the study table we have given at a very nice height for the kid to sit. And we have given few shelves and drawers over here. We are in the master bedroom now and all this furniture over here in the master bedroom is designed in the factory of Bolito. Now this bed has a really nice storage and we have given a side table which is attached to the bed and which is continuing with a rafter and the rafter continues to the dressing table which has the same colored laminates, drawers and a uh, few open shelves. So on the left hand side we have given a triangular shape cabinets which are open you can keep anything you want over here and this actually helps in increasing the walking area over here now over here we've given sliding wardrobe with very fancy handles and which are designed the same two laminates as the bed and we've given a loft so to continue the same harmony in the room we've given a rafter with some spotlights and under that we've given a very minimal tv unit using the same laminates now over here we've given a very minimal study table and on top there is a very huge storage for the, all the books you can keep. I'm telling from the start to you that that it's, it's, when we saw the initial yes. design and these things, right? Since then we were thinking that we it's were going to be a... Uh, initially, yeah, initially we were thinking that we'll shift later than uh, after Diwali or something. Then my, my parents also told me Diwali or two. Then after seeing all, everything, right? So we thought, no, no, let's try to we make it as soon as possible. Home. Because if it is delayed, it will be a problem for us. Like uh, that design and these things, it will, it will delay this. Yeah. And so. when you saw your designs on the sketch of the 3D model, like when it got executed, how did you feel? Like was it exactly the same or was it better than that? 
It's better, better than that. Obviously, it's better than that. All credit goes to Yashas. <laughs> <laughs> so, how was your experience with Yashas and uh, the project manager, Ramesh? Yashas, it was awesome. Uh, yeah, it's an awesome experience. Great. <laughs> because uh, whatever requirements we told him, and everything he came, every time he came up with a very nice design and everything, whatever requirements for each and every corner of our house, he came up with very, yes. very nice designs. Yes. And I, I, I will tell you one thing, when I went to HSR site, that time one madam told me that no, you will get the designer from HSR because thing is, I don't want to drive much. So I told her that I need one person from HSR only, I will not go to Hipal. So she said, this is confirmed, you pay the money, you will get the person from HSR. So we, we thought, okay, we'll HSR someone will get and after two days we got an email that HSR will be our designer and uh, here we have to go Hipal. After getting the email, I called that madam and I said, I will not go to Hipal and why you have assigned to me assigned me a designer from uh, Hipal? So she said, no, we don't have designer and these things. So I was thinking it's going to be a big problem for me. So I called Yasha and she told me, no, you have to come to Hipal, I cannot come. I went, somehow I went. But after that, my experience with the Yasha's right. Uh, I'm totally happy. I'm, I'm, I'm very I'm lucky having, to yes, have having the Yasha's, frankly speaking. <laughs> and what about the execution phase? Uh, See, execution phase from the start it was good. It was good, but there uh, there was some hiccups that uh, these two people know, and it happens because uh, because uh, this is a very big project and you are people are managing many projects. Right? It happens. I understand this, but sometimes a time constraint and these things those were a uh, little bit. Uh, Frustrating me actually. I told to these two guys, mm -hmm. but uh, I understand. I understand. As such, uh, it was it was good. Totally good. Is, uh, uh, Ramesh always helped me. He always helped me. Uh, when I asked something, he properly answered me those things. Um, I'm happy with uh, Ramesh also. Mm -hmm. Great. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, if you have to rate Bonito out of ten. Say in designing phase, how much uh, will you give? In designing phase, I will. <laughs> That's great. Yeah. <laughs> 11? Designing phase 11, yes. And execution. Okay, out of 10. <laughs> <laughs> out of 10. <laughs> Thank you. So, frankly, design was super. Design was super because uh, when I asked uh, Yashas, I told him that you design something, but it should not be a clumsy, like there should be a proper space also. So, he designed that room only. So, yeah, we are getting enough of space also, yeah. and every. Uh, part is covered, TV unit, foyer, crockery, everything we are having and this means we are having enough space uh, in spite of that also. Actually when I visited the site, uh, client was very much worried about the partitions. Mm -hmm. when, yeah. when, when, when I was in the first site visit, they were like, can I have all the units in the in my house? And I was like, no sir, we will, we will do it. <laughs> and finally we are done. Great. Initially, because of space, we have cancelled uh, that uh, TV. MBR TV unit and we have cancelled uh, something in the kids' bedroom also. But when the design come and the exhibition start, right, it was totally good. That we have space also, we have proper design also. That's really nice, yeah. And what about the execution phase? How much would you like to rate? I will rate approx 8. 8? Yeah. That's so good. Yes, yes. So, so, as a conclusion, what do you want to say, like the end thing about Bonito? How was the whole yeah. overall experience? I already suggested four, four of my people. Actually, they visited, they visited uh, this flat and they thought, okay, no, we have to go with the Bonito only. They liked everything they liked. And is she happy? Like, happy with her room? She was very much particular about the color of her pink. room. Pink. Pink. <laughs> and red. So, we chose pink for her. And she's very happy. She's very happy with yeah. the room. Are you very happy with the mess master bedroom and the kitchen? Yes, 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 I think yes. Thank you so much. Thank you. So this was all about Neha Mohit Bajaj's house. And for more info, please log into www.bonito.in. And for more squadro furniture, please log into squadro.in. Thank you.